I find inspiration in South Africans getting the narrative to tell their stories. I'm inspired by every single human being's innate ability to change things. It's the next generation. It's the kids that I see on the streets. It's making sure that they don't face the same challenges that we face. And I think it's people, for me, that generate inspiration. And inspiration is what, what drives me. Uh, as a writer and a journalist, I think that I would say other people's passions inspires me. I woke up one day and I decided, okay, this is not enough for me. This is it. Kind of like thing I want. I need to figure out what the what the hell's going on in the world. And then I set out to create a company or program that changes things. Kind of like, and ask the right questions, the relevant questions. I work with young people to help bridge young people with the rest of the world, to help build young people, to empower them and give them the creative confidence to do whatever the hell they wanted to do. I guess that's where it starts with being a change maker, to figure out what you want, to, what you want in the world and how you're going to do that. If we really become self-reflective and conscious human beings and have empathy and communicate with one another, especially around understanding the deep psychological and emotional scars of our haunted past, then we're moving one step forward towards a harmonious South Africa. I truly believe that my contribution in co-creating South Africa is through producing cultural exchange programs such as the Borg Exchange, in an attempt to realize true reconciliation in our lifetime. If we really want to find solutions for, um, for the problems that we're facing, whether it's in our own city, whether it's in our own South Africa, or whether it's in the world, we, we have to work together. We have to listen to each other. Um, we have to sit around the table. People who are not used to not used to sit around the table together, um, you know, from all ranks of life, from all walks of life. We need to really collaborate um, and I think that's, that's in the end is a message of, of co-creators. Eh? I think one thing that I learned um, through these change makers that it is not about um, aid or development. These young guys and women, they are so connected. We're working now with the Dutch Consulate on the Department of Design, so we're now looking at ideas beyond Cape Town, beyond South Africa, and trying to see what are those core sustainability issues that are actually affecting different parts of the country. So whether it's transport or healthier rivers um, or electricity in rural areas, we're now part of a bigger conversation and program to, to co-create South Africa where you know, we're open to ideas from abroad. So South Africa and Netherlands actually have a conversation based on our local needs, but actually draws in a bigger audience, draws in young people, um, and, and you know, inspires more people to be change makers. <laughs>